Alrighty, hello guys, welcome your faces back to another video on my channel. Today we are back in Stormworks yet again, and today we're continuing on with the IFB. Now, a lot of you guys have been saying uh, the rockets aren't very good, and you should replace them with missiles. Now, I think that's what we're going to do today. We're going to replace the rockets with missiles, or we can just add missiles to the rockets. I don't know what's a better idea here, I don't know. Anyway, um, the first thing that I want to test is something that I forgot to test out last time. We're going to go ahead and drive this thing off of here and try and land it in the water and see if it lets in water if it lands in it, if that makes sense. Um, I do believe that it will, um, and the main reason for that is um, the, the way that it actually falls out, if that makes sense. So, if we drive this forwards off of here, it's going to fall face down, and if it falls face down, um, the water will go in. Yeah. Anyway, let's go ahead and drive off. Here we go. And pop the parachutes. Woo! Oh my goodness. There we go. Right. Parachutes have been popped. Excellent. So as you guys can see, because we've driven off forwards, uh, it is angled downwards. And it, I mean, it might work. It might still work. We'll have to see. But I highly doubt it. But at the same time, we've actually added some control surfaces, which do negate it a little bit. So we'll, we'll have to see. Anyway, we're going down. Let's go ahead and uh, turn on the lights. Hey, there we go. All right, how fast are we going down? Oh. 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 Oh, 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 oh. Guys, it works. Guys, it actually works. That's really cool. That is really cool. Did any water get in? I don't think so. That's awesome. That's really awesome. All right, another test. Will water go in if we drive it straight off of here? I don't know. I feel like testing it a little bit. So here we go. And in the water. No. Okay, that's amazing. That's really cool. Anyway, let's do the missile thing. Let's do this. All right, so I'm actually going to go ahead and change the color back to this because honestly, I kind of like this color the most. So that's why we're going to use this. Anyway, the next thing we're going to do is delete this guy, delete this guy, this guy, this guy, and that guy right there. We're then going to get ourselves some hard points. Here we go. And we're going to strap those to there and also there. I think like that. Okay, excellent. Bit weird, but sure. Going to attach that onto there and do that like that. Interesting. Okay, that's kind of, kind of cool. So, let's go ahead and save this as IFV uh, missiles. There we go. IFV missiles. Good. So, now we need to design missiles that go on here and... I don't think we necessarily need to design new ones, and I don't want this on the side. We're going to go ahead and just attach it onto there like this. Because why not? We might as well have them in the same place. Okay, so, um, I don't see a point in designing new missiles. We might as well take some off of one of our previous creations. So, let's try and find a creation. And, um, yeah, we'll use it. Alright, here we go. So, this is it. This is it. So, let's just go ahead and grab one of these. It has the radar, it has the warhead, it then has the uh, the connector, and it has the booster on the back. So, if we cut this, we load up our IFV missiles. There we go. And we uh, essentially just put this on there. This would be awesome. Here we go. Bring it up. Bring it sideways. And bring it forwards. And paste it there like that. Good. Move it over. Do the same. Move it over. Do the same. And do the same again. Bosh. All right, okay, so we now have missiles. That's interesting, isn't it? <laughs> they look weird. They look very weird. Um, I do kind of feel like angling them off to the side now because I feel like they're stuck up a little bit too much. We can maybe change that. We'll see. Anyway, let's go ahead and paint it real quick in the same color as the rest of it. Boop, and there we go. And boop, there we go. Very nice. Okay, so in order to actually launch these then, uh, what do we need to do? What do we need to do? Just press launch on this. Okay, so let's say it's on the weapon system, which I feel like it should be. We're going to go with one uh, on this one. Uh, launch. There we go. We're going to go with two on the outside one over there as well. Here we go. So two. Three is going to be this one. And then four. Da -da 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 -da, four is going to be this guy over here. Bam. Okay, will all of that work? I'm not so sure. We'll see. Attach that down to there. Do these two together and attach it to there. Let's see what happens. This is going to be interesting. We'll have to repaint this as well, but that's fine. For now, it's okay. Open Sesame. Jump inside. Close it. We now need to get ourselves something to aim at. And I have the perfect thing, actually. 
All right, it's quite a small target, but it is a target nevertheless. So if we go ahead and we zoom in on this, there's, whoa, there's the target right there. We are aiming directly towards it. Okay. Oh, I wish it was less sticky, but that's okay. Three, two, one, fire. I think we missed. Two. Oh, it's going underneath it. Three. It's, it's actually sliding underneath. That's really strange. That's really, really weird. So it's going between the tracks. Like it's actually slotting through there. And then hitting the mountain? That is weird. Uh, what we'll do is we'll actually jump inside. And we'll aim it higher this time. So turn the screens on. Uh, wherever that is. This bit. There we go. Good. Go ahead and aim it towards the target. But aim a little bit higher. So here. Okay, press 1. That hit the target. Yes, it did. Let's go and press 2. Oh, that went through the floor. Aim a little bit higher. Press 3. Oh, that missed. And then 4. That also missed. It feels like they're getting very close, but they're all missing. And then what about the gun? Does the gun work? Is that is that something that works? quite a strong gun, I'm not going to lie. It is quite a strong gun. Yeah. It's quite hard to aim as well, though. That's a problem. But, um, yeah. Cool. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and change the color of this back to whatever. I guess it doesn't really matter, but I'm going to go ahead and change it back to this. And, um, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and try and fix it a little bit more than that by using this on these pieces. Push, 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 push. It's a different color to what it was before, but that's okay. Go to the other side and do the same thing. Push, push, push. Bush, 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 bush. There we go. Very good. Grab this color and whack, 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 whack. There we go. And I'm good. So, the other thing that we might be able to do is actually aim it at that up there and see if we can hit that instead. I don't know. We'll see. Here we go. Inside the vehicle we go. And yeah, it's a little bit more of a uh, more uh, crazy target, I guess. So, let's get outside. There we go. Aim sort of towards it. There we go. Jump in this seat, aim towards the, uh... Oh, can we not do it? Are the missiles in, like... The missiles are actually in a, in a place where we can't aim upwards. That's annoying. But if we aim sideways, then we can aim upwards? Sort of? <laughs> if, we, if we go sideways, we can kind of aim upwards. Okay. We don't really have that much leeway on this. But let's go ahead and launch one and see what happens. I don't know where that went. Oh, it missed. Only just, though, but it did miss. Oh, my goodness. Hang on. Turn the engine off. We can't aim at things above us. Not, it's not going to happen. But what about that? Again. All right, here we go. Aim. Aim higher. Three, two, one, go. They dive so much, and I don't know why. It's like they're going normally, and then they go, whoop. And I'm not sure why feel like they've been made wrong. Hmm. All right, I've messed around with one of the uh one of the radars on one of the one of the um blah, 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 rockets, missiles, thingamabobbies. Let's go ahead and turn that on, direct it towards there and it is number 4. So let's go ahead and name it. There we go. We're sort of right. Press 4. I think it did the same thing as it previously did. 3. See, that one went straight down, but the other one didn't. Okay. So let's go to the one next to it. Here we go. Cut it. Flip it round and have it on the bottom. I don't know whether this is going to work either, but let's see. It may work, it may not work. Direct it towards the target. There we go. Press three. Now that one went straight down. Four. They're all doing the same thing, actually. They are all doing the same thing. That was a lot better, though. Oh, that was a lot better. Hang on, that was loads better. Uh, oh, those are different, actually. Hang on, hang on. It's That's one. That's two. No. I can't remember which way around this is. I can't remember. Oh, yikes. Okay, so do that. I should have looked at the seat, but never mind. Right, we know which, which rocket we're talking about. So one is the one all the way on the left. That's fine. 
Let's go ahead and raise this up. I think that I actually did hit the target there. Yeah. All right, aim left a bit. Press two. Three, two, one, go. All right, that missed. Three. That one I haven't changed. And that one did hit the target. Okay, that one hit the target. And then four is the inside one right here. And that missed. <laughs> okay, right. I, I don't know what's going on. I feel like they do actually work as long as I aim them correctly. So, uh, let's go ahead and cut this. Flip it over again. There we go. Actually, no, wait. How is it supposed to be? Like that? But the other way. Is that right? I don't know. Bam. Okay, merge that with this. I feel like that should be on the bottom. I'm not going to lie. I feel like it should be. Anyway, cut this one. Flip it around, do random stuff with it. There we go, press U. Okay, but that's the wrong way around. There, right, paste it, merge it. There, okay, right, is that gonna be fine? I don't know whether that's gonna be okay. Right, here we go. Do, 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 yes, yes, okay. For some reason I've managed to pick up some ammo, but that's all right. Aim higher, three, two, one. They do work. They, they totally do work. That's cool. Okay, so what I'm going to do now then is uh, I'm going to sort of, I don't know, make this bit look a little bit nicer by adding that to there. And I'm also going to go ahead and add that to there. And I think that looks okay. Good. So now we've got missiles instead of rockets. I think they sort of look all right. They do work. Uh, we've tested out that it can actually fall off there. Oh. Uh, it can actually fall off there into the water and still be fine. Um, I do want to test something else though. So let's go ahead and save this real quick. We're going to go ahead and drive this one off the top of that. But we're not going to pop out a parachute. And we're going to see what happens. Alright, here we go. So let's go ahead and turn on the lights. Go ahead and turn on the monitors. Turn on the headlights. Go ahead and turn on the engine. And throttle it up and go. I feel like this is going to be bad. But let's let's see. We need We need to do some sort of crash test with it. Okay, it landed, and it is in the water. We put our reverse gear on. And we're alive. I don't know how it just did that, but it did. <laughs> so I'm actually really pleased with that. That's cool. Anyway, uh, I'm going to go ahead and end this video here for now. Thank you guys very much for watching. Uh, what I'll do is I'll put this on the workshop very soon. I might do some more modifications to it. But, um, yeah, I think I'm happy with it, to be honest. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed it. See you next time. Goodbye.